I'm the Milky Way, a barred spiral galaxy. You now see, with an estimated visible diameter of 100 to 200,000 light years across me. I'm the Milky Way, this song is about facts of my galaxy. I'm not the biggest, but I'm the one you call home, actually. I am the Milky Way, the galaxy, you are all a part of. Your solar system's a small part of me, here's more of me you love. Your galaxy is a gravitationally bound collection of stars and a spiral swirling through space that's what you know about me this far i am one in about two trillion galaxies in this observable universe let's give some examples of my size in the coming verse i do have a which is measured from my center to the edge of me which in light years measures 52,850 when you measure me from one edge across my entirety I'm about a hundred thousand light years across as you can plainly see I do probably contain 100 to 400 billion stars you know that's an estimate that humans created but there could be more to show to give you an example of my size well we'll look to my neighbor and see the spectacle goes by the name of the andromeda galaxy if you measure the Andromeda across from one side to the other, it's about 220,000 light years wide. It's my big brother. This is IC1101 galaxy. I will now share. It spans as much as 4 million light years. That's a lot bigger if we're there are a lot of other things bigger than this called superclusters. Laniakea is a good example. I am part of its hard to muster. The Laniakea supercluster is thought to be in size 520 million light years in estimate humans comprise the next time you think earth is the center of the universe you know remember you're just a speck floating in trillions of galaxies in a space unknown My name is Four Vesta, the asteroid, one of the largest asteroids in the asteroid belt. Please enjoy. The asteroid belt is located roughly between Mars and Jupiter. I'm the second largest asteroid on the scene. I was discovered by German astronomer Hendrik Olbers, and that is for sure. In the month of March in 1807, when looking I was named Vesta after the Roman goddess of home and hearth. It was easy and flawless. I was named by the famous mathematician called Frederick Gauss. He was such a vision. I am one of the largest objects you should know. In the asteroid belt is where I glow. The asteroid belt is located roughly between the orbits of Jupiter and Mars. That's where I'm seen. This is the second.
second largest known asteroid by both mass and by volume. That's knowledge to enjoy. I'm the second largest two dwarf planet series, the closest dwarf to the sun in your solar system. See, my mean diameter is 525 kilometers or 326 miles if the metric system's unfamiliar. I'm the brightest asteroid that is visible from Earth, but not quite a dwarf. I guess I need some more girth. At a distance of 220 million kilometers from the planet of Earth, for what that is worth, NASA's Dawn spacecraft entered orbit around me in the year of 2011, July the 16th. Dawn stayed for a one year exploration and left my orbit when it reached its completion on the 5th of September in 2012. I hope you come back to visit and I hope you are well. I'm one of the four largest asteroids in the asteroid belt from biggest to smallest. Their names are spelled Ceres, Vesta, Pallas, and Hygieia. That's enough about me. Yeah, I guess I will see you. My name is Four Vesta, the asteroid, one of the largest asteroids in the asteroid belt. Please enjoy. The asteroid belt is located roughly between Mars and Jupiter. I'm the second largest asteroid on the scene. We're astronomical objects brought to you here by Psi. Some within Neptune's orbit, others trans-Neptunian we fly. We're astronomical objects brought to you here by size. We all orbit the sun that may come as some surprise. I'm Phoebe, an irregular satellite of Saturn. I be my alternative name is Saturnine. You can see, discovered in 1899 by William Pickering. My diameter is 213 kilometers while I do my thing. I'm 10199 Caraclo, an asteroid with rings the largest confirmed small body of the outer solar system I sing I'm possibly a door planet with a measured diameter of 232 kilometers I'm sure I'm 38628 who ya a minor planet in your system or trans Neptunian object is my technical term as I'm spun you can find me in the Kuiper belt in the outer solar system my diameter is 406 kilometers how fun I'm 2000 18 BG 18 of this I am sure a trans Neptunian object don't leave there is more first observed in 2018 by three astronomers 500 kilometers is my known diameter my name is Vesta I'm a minor planet you now know I'm one of the largest objects in the asteroid belt I do show I'm probably the second largest asteroid after Ceres I have a mean diameter of 500 25 kilometers you see. I'm 2014 UZ 224, a trans Neptunian object and possibly a dwarf planet, but the IAU hasn't decided yet. Out in the Kuiper belt, I was discovered. I am sure 635 kilometers is my diameter. I'm 20,000 Varuna, a large trans Neptunian object in the Kuiper belt. I dwell in possible dwarf, but not yet. My elongated shape is due to my rapid. Rotation 668 kilometers is my diameter well spun. I am Ceres, I am a dwarf planet. I'm the largest object in the main asteroid belt to orbit. I am too dim to be seen by the naked eye for sure. I am 946 kilometers in diameter. My name is Senna, I am a minor planet. I'm three times as far as Neptune from the sun. My surface is one of the reddest among the solar system objects. I'm 995 kilometers in diameter. Glad we met. My name is Quora, and I'm a dwarf planet candidate. But for now, I'm a non-resonant trans-Neptunian object. I reside in the Kuiper Belt. It's so cold here. Burr. And I'm 1110 kilometers in diameter. Not 2007 OR10, that name it stood strong with the proposed name in 2019 of Gong Gong. My furthest distance is 9.4 billion miles from the sun. My diameter is 1230.
30 kilometers as I run Not Maki Maki, a minor planet I be I'm perhaps the second largest object in the Kuiper Belt you see I was discovered in 2005 by a team led by Michael Brown And currently 1430 kilometers in diameter And I'm round Almea is my name, I'm a dwarf planet by fame Beyond Neptune's orbit you can find me with some aim I'm the third largest known trans-Neptunian object I'm 1632 kilometers in diameter last I checked My name is Ceres, I am a dwarf planet as well And the second largest dwarf planet in the solar system How swell, located beyond the Kuiper Belt In a region called the Scattered Disk My diameter in kilometers is 2326 I'm Pluto no, I'm a big deal as the largest door planet I used to be the ninth planet in the solar system till I quit I am part of the cold and lonely Kuiper Belt My diameter is 2376 kilometers so I tell We're astronomical objects brought to you here by size Some within Neptune's orbit, others trans-Neptunian we fly we're astronomical objects brought to you here by size We all orbit the sun that may come as some surprise We are some planets, all different in size Here's our planetary size comparison for you live We'll look at each planet, measured by their radius here there are so many planets that will appear I am Ceres I am felt as the largest object in the asteroid belt I am Orcus to be direct I'm a trans-Neptunian object I'm known as Sedna if you can stand it I'm a large minor planet I am Quora You may respect As a trans-Neptunian object My name's kind of funny It's Maki Maki I am a dwarf planet Yeah, that's me Haumea is my name I'm six in line with fame A dwarf planet yeah, we're not all the same My name is Eris I am a dwarf planet The most massive dwarf in your system yet You know me as Pluto I was a planet, but now dwarf you know I hope the IAU puts me back as a planet though Who's Kepler-37B? Wait a minute, that's me! An extrasolar planet that you now see I am Mercury, the second hottest as I'm spun I'm in your solar system, closest planet to your sun Come visit this planet so far to learn all about Mars I'm the 10th largest planet, but not really in charge my name is Venus, for what that is worth I'm almost the same size as your beautiful Earth I'm the Earth on this planetary run Please take care of me, I'm the planet you all live on Proxima Centauri B, I'm the planet you see An exoplanet in a habitable zone, you degree Have you heard about me? Kepler 10B is my name I have a rocky surface, I'm amazing, some do claim My surface is a furnace, I'm Coro 7B 489 light years from the Earth, that's me Neptune centers Earth size in my atmosphere's methane, hydrogen, and helium And I'm the most distant from our burning sun I'm Uranus, the planet seventh from the sun Yet I'm blue with 13 rings, I'm sure we have met You know me as Saturn with rings, this is true I have the most moons in the solar system, now 82 
I'm Jupiter, the largest planet in the solar system. I am the fifth planet from the sun. I'm an extrasolar planet, this is 51 Pegasi B. Some think my atmosphere contains water that we may see. I am a planet, my name's Gliss 876D. An extrasolar planet up in this mix, that's me. I'm named HT 100546B. I am designated the largest known planet you see. We are some planets, all different in size Here's our planetary size comparison for you live We'll look at each planet, measured by their radius here There are so many planets that will appear Here's a moon size comparison in our solar system We're happy if you shed some light on us until we are done we're measured by our radius, you'll hear in a bit We'll also tell you the planet in which we orbit My name is Tethys, I'm one of Saturn's 82 moons My radius is 531 kilometers, it is true I am Dion, I orbit Saturn, you do see My radius is 561 kilometers, that is me Ariel is my name, Uranus is what I orbit My radius is 578 kilometers, I'm third on the list I am Umbriel, Uranus is where I'm from My radius is 584 kilometers, I am spun I'm the moon of Sharon, I float in orbit Pluto radius is 606 kilometers, this I do know I'm Iapetus, a moon of Saturn Radius of 734 kilometers as I turn Oberon is my name, outermost moon of Uranus 761 kilometers is my radius I am Rhea Saturn's second largest moon radius of 763 kilometers see you soon here's a moon size comparison in our solar system we're happy if you shed some light on us until we are done we're measured by our radius you'll hear in a bit we'll also tell you the planet in which we orbit not Titania, the largest moon of Uranus 788 kilometers is my radius The name is Triton, the largest moon of Neptune I'm 1353 kilometers in radius in this tune Europa is frozen and the moon of Jupiter My radius is 1560 kilometers I am the moon of the planet my radius is 1737 kilometers for what it's worth Hello, I'm Io, the strangest moon of Jupiter With a radius of 1821 kilometers I'm Callisto, I orbit Jupiter, you see My radius is 2410 kilometers, that's all on me Titan is my name, Saturn's my claim to fame 2574 kilometers is my radius Yes, I claim I'm gonna meet the largest moon in the solar system Jupiter is what I orbit, yeah, that's where I'm from My radius is 2634 kilometers now Let's listen to the chorus while the moons take a bow Here's a moon-sized comparison in our solar system We're happy if you shed some light on us until we are done we're measured by our radius, you'll hear in a bit We'll also tell you the planet in which we orbit There's over 200 billion galaxies In the observable universe that we might see Let's look at this galaxy size comparison From small to big, of course, now here we come I'm Segway 2, I'm a dwarf spheroidal galaxy Situated in the constellation of Aries 
My radius is 110.89 light years, they say. Discovered in 2009 by Sloan Digital Sky Survey. My name's Messier32, a dwarf early type galaxy, am I? 2.65 million light years from Earth, I fly. I was discovered in the year of 1749. I am 6,500 light years across, and that's just fine. I'm small, Magellanic Cloud, or Nubicula Minor, a dwarf irregular. Galaxy, there's nothing finer. I'm near the Milky Way, but not a stone's toss. My diameter's about 7,000 light years across. I'm Triangulum, a spiral galaxy. You see, sometimes I'm referred to as a pinwheel galaxy. I was discovered officially in 1764. I'm 50,000 light years across. This info is now yours. I'm the Whirlpool Galaxy, also called Messier 51. I'm a spiral galaxy, my arms reach out while I'm spun. I was first discovered in the year of 1773. 76,000 light years is the distance across me. I'm the Milky Way Galaxy, a gigantic spiral disk with a bright central bulge that you can't miss. I'm 100,000 light years, your sun is 8 kpc from my center. On what is known as Orion's arm, it's a real bender. I'm Hope's object, a non-typical galaxy of the type known as a ring galaxy, as you can see. 121,000 light years across, bigger than the Milky Way, discovered by author Hogan, 1958. There's over 200 billion galaxies in the observable universe that we might see. Let's look at this galaxy size comparison from small to big, of course, now here we come. I'm the Cartwheel Galaxy, a lenticular and ring galaxy, discovered by Fritz Wicke in 1941. I'm 150,000 light years across, my beauty is number one. I am M101, also known as the Pinwheel Galaxy, discovered by Pierre Michon in 1781, if you please. I'm 170,000 light years across, nearly twice the size of the Milky Way, now that's quite a toss. I'm the Andromeda Galaxy, a spiral galaxy, I say, in the nearest major galaxy to your Milky Way. My name stems from the constellation of Andromeda. I'm 220,000 light years across, I'll be seeing ya. I'm NGC 6872, also known as Condor Galaxy. I'm a large part spiral galaxy, I'm sure you'd agree. Discovered in 1835 by John Herschel, the boss. I'm very large at 700,000 light years across. I'm the giant temple galaxy, a disrupted part spiral, you see. I was discovered in the year of 2018. I'm 10 times the size of the Milky Way that's extremely large my friend. I'm 1 million light years long from end to end. I'm IC 1101, a supergiant elliptical galaxy. I'm one of the largest known galaxies found in your universe. You see, discovered in the year of 1790 by John Herschel. 6 million light years across what stars I am full. There's over 200 billion galaxies in the observable universe that we might see. Let's look at this galaxy size comparison from small to big. Of course, now here we come. This is a size comparison of objects in our universe. We'll start with the smallest and go to the largest, most well-known objects we know, of course. I am Ceres, I am a dwarf planet. Maki Maki's a dwarf planet as well, but didn't plan it. I am Haumea, a dwarf planet in this group. Pluto is a dwarf, but used to be a planet, it's true. Ceres is a dwarf planet in this mix. The Earth's moon is where your eyes are transfixed. Mercury is here, an official planet. I'm the planet of Mars, I'm sure you all know this. I'm planet Venus, my size you may think is large. Planet Earth is next, and the humans think that they're in charge. Neptune's a planet in our solar system, wow! Planet Uranus 
places here I wish I could take a bow. Planet Saturn has rings if you think I am big. Check out Planet Jupiter, I hope you can dig. This is a size comparison of objects in our universe. We'll start with the smallest and go to the largest, most well-known objects we know, of course. I am the sun, a yellow dwarf that isn't far. I am Sirius A, a main sequence star. My name is Pollux, a red giant star, it's true. Arcturus is a red giant star, this I thought you knew. I'm Aldebaran, a red giant star, that's me. Hi, I'm Rigel, a blue white super giant, you see. I am Beetlejuice, and I'm a red super giant in class. I'm in Tories, I'm a red super giant that won't last. VY Canis Majoris, a red hyper giant star. I'm UI Scutai, the biggest red super giant this far. I am the Milky Way galaxy, and you Let's all sing the chorus together with glee. This is a size comparison of objects in our universe. We'll start with the smallest and go to the largest, most well-known objects we know, of course. This is a size comparison of objects in our universe. We'll start with the smallest and go to the largest, most well-known objects we know, of course. We're all stars, we're all stars compared to each other by size. You can see a lot of us when you look into the night sky. We're all stars, we're all stars, our colors vary, you know We're made mostly of hydrogen and helium, here we go I'm the Crab Pulsar, a young neutron star I'm Calvera, an isolated neutron star that's far My name's Bela X1, I'm a neutron star as well Sirius B, that's me, a small white dwarf as you can tell I'm EBLMJO555-57AB My name's Trappist-1, an ultra-cool red dwarf star in sight I'm Proxima Centauri, a main sequence red dwarf star I am your sun, a yellow dwarf that isn't too far Alpha Centauri A is an orange star, you see I am Sirius A, a main sequence star, that's me We're all stars, we're all stars Compared to each other by size You can see a lot of us when you look into the night sky We're all stars, we're all stars Our colors vary, you know We're made mostly of hydrogen and helium Here we go! VFTS-352, contact binary 1 and 2 Composed of two very hot, bright and massive stars that orbit each other, it's true My name is Pollux, a red giant star here Arcturus is a red giant star, I hope I made that clear R136A1 is a wolf riot star thus far I'm Aldebaran, a red giant star, that's me Rigel is here, a blue-white super giant you can see. I am Beetlejuice and I'm a red super giant in class. VY Canis Majoris, a red hypergiant star with mass. I'm UI Scutai, the biggest red super giant this far. Join us to sing the chorus, now get your head out of the stars. We're all stars, we're all stars, compared to each other by size. You can see a lot of us when you look into the night sky. 
We're all stars, we're all stars, our colors vary, you know We're made mostly of hydrogen and helium, here we go We're all stars, we're all stars, compared to each other by size You can see a lot of us when you look into the night sky We're all stars, we're all stars, our colors vary, you know We're made mostly of hydrogen and helium, here we go My name is Magdalu, I'm on the planet Earth I'm the fifth highest mountain in the world, you've learned this in this verse I'm on the border of Nepal and China I'm 5.26 miles tall, what could be finer? I'm Lotse, on planet Earth as well The fourth highest peak on Earth, on me not many dwell I'm located on the border of China and Nepal I'm 5.29 miles tall Kong Cheng Jenga Earth is what I call home I'm the third highest peak above sea level On Earth come Rome Part of the Himalayas in Nepal and India You see at 5.33 miles tall I'm sure you'll notice me I'm known as K2 Earth is where I am found I'm the second highest mountain above sea level around In the Himalayas Shared between China and Pakistan I'm 5.35 miles high If you visit, have a plan I'm Mount Everest Earth 
my obvious location I'm the highest peak on earth Above sea level, come here on vacation I call the Himalayas home I separate China and Nepal I'm 5.49 miles in height Come climb me and have a ball I'm on Ikea, the earth is where I lay I'm on the island of Hawaii Where lots of people come to stay I'm the tallest mountain in the world Measured beneath the sea At my base at 6.34 miles high Come climb my mountain face I'm called Pavonis Mons On the planet of Mars I'm bigger than Mauna Kea So I'm raising the bar I am 7th highest on this list And a giant in the skyline It's 6.8 miles tall A shield volcano am I Elysium Mons That's my name you had learned I'm on the planet of Mars Let me continue my turn I'm the 8th highest mountain on this list At 7.8 miles tall I'm a volcano to climb my wall I'm Ascreus Mons Also on Mars the planet I come in ninth place on this list This I admit I'm a large shield volcano Located in the Tharsis region At 9.3 miles high To climb me wouldn't be fun I'm Olympus Mons I sit tall on the planet of Mars I'm the largest mountain In the solar system by far I'm a very large shield volcano In the big in our system my height is 13.7 miles high and now i'm done this is a size comparison of mountains in our solar system so you know we all orbit the sun we'll work from small to large until we're done we're not all the mountains of the solar system just the largest ones We're the world's tallest buildings Here to tell you about ourselves The views from our tops are quite chilling In the world's tallest buildings We celebrate the architects who created us And the people we bring I'm China Sun, the tallest building in Beijing That is in China, in case you were wondering At a height of 1731 feet tall I was built by the CITIC, as I recall 4.7 million square feet and 109 floors within me I was completed in the year of 2018 Tianjin CTF Finance Center is my name The second tallest building in Tianjin, China That's my fame My height is 1739 feet An impressive size and I'm owned by Chow Taifuk The Enterprise Over 2.7 million square feet and 97 floors inside me I was completed in the year of 2019 Guangzhou CTF Finance Center is located in Guangzhou, China. We hope you enter. Also 1,739 feet tall. Also owned by Chow Taifuk Enterprises, that's not all. I'm 5.4 million square feet and 111 floors completed in 2016 and I am adored. I am one World Trade Center and located in the state of New York. In the USA I've been I'm 1,792 feet from the ground to my tip Owned by New York and New Jersey Port Authority Now this I'm 3.5 million square feet And 94 floors as seen And I was completed in the year of 2014 I'm Latte World Tower It's nice to meet ya I am located in Seoul, South Korea I'm 1,821 feet in height Owned by Latte Property and development, that's right At 3.2 million square feet and 123 floors Completed in 2016, come visit me on tour Golden Finance, 117 Tower Located in Tianjin, China and full of power 1,957 feet tall, you know Golden Properties, Holdings, develop me though You'll find 4 million square feet 117 stories here My completion should be in 2020 the year I'm the Pingyang Finance Center There's nothing finer Located in Shenzhen Within China It's 1966 feet From the ground to my tip Pingyang Group owns me Now you all know this 4.9 million square feet And 115 floors and lean 
I was completed in the year of 2017. Mecca Royal Hotel Clock Tower, I will show ya. Located in Mecca, Saudi Arabia. I'm 1,972 feet to my top, and I'm government owned. I'll be here till I drop. 21.5 million square feet and 124s in me. Completed in 2011, I think that is plenty. I'm known as the Shanghai Tower. Tallest tower in Shanghai, China. I hope I empower. 2,073 feet from the sky to my cement. I'm owned by Shanghai Tower Construction and Development. Over 4 million square feet and 128 floors within. Completed in 2014, where have you been? This is the Borsh Khalifa, located in Dubai, in the United Arab Emirates. That's where I climb high. I'm 2,722 feet. All from the ground to tip Owned by Amar Properties Yet I'm still hip With a total built up area Of 5.6 million square feet And 163 floors A size that can't be beat Completed in 2009 I'm the tallest tower in the world to date If you ever make it to Dubai To see me would be great We're the world's tallest buildings Here to tell you about ourselves The views from our tops are quite chilling In the world World's tallest buildings We celebrate the architects who created us and the people we bring We are pyramids Yeah, we're all man-made We are architecture of new and ancient ancestry We are pyramids of old and modern time We will show you our location Come visit us and climb I'm the Memphis Pyramid In Memphis, Tennessee Built of steel and concrete Modern tools built me I was built for sports and concerts In 1991 Now used as a bass pro shop For fishermen fun Isaac Tigret placed a crystal skull Within me When it was removed bad luck struck I'm known as the tomb of doom you see 322 feet high and 10th largest on this list 535,000 square feet now you know this I'm the Ben Pyramid in Dushur, Egypt built way back when I'm made of limestone blocks built by the hands of men I was built for Pharaoh Sneferu in the 4th dynasty yeah I was constructed in 2600 BC at 344 feet tall and the 9th largest you see here come to Egypt to visit me I'll be here for years I'm the Red Pyramid located in Giza, Egypt Made of red limestone My hue is why I was called this Also built for Pharaoh Sneferu in the 4th Dynasty It ranged from 2613 to 2589 BC At 345 feet tall, I'm smooth sided, not stepped I hope you come to explore me in Egypt This is the Luxor Hotel in Las Vegas, Nevada on the strip finished in 1993 built with modern tools i'm hip i have over 4400 rooms that you can comfortably stay in i was built to entertain some people lose some people win 350 feet tall i'm made of glass and steel if you come to vegas come see me i have curb appeal the pyramid of cafe he's egypt's my location made of huge limestone blocks built by the hands of men built for the tomb of the great pharaoh Khafre, you know the second largest and second tallest pyramid of giza i show i'm 448 feet tall which puts me fifth on this list come visit if you can thanks for learning all this i'm the great pyramid of giza giza egypt's where you'll find me i'm the oldest and the largest pyramid of the three egyptologists believe I was built as a tomb for the 4th dynasty Egyptian Pharaoh Khufu I was 481 feet before erosion occurred at all But since that happened now I'm 455 feet tall The Transamerica Pyramid in San Francisco, California Built with concrete, glass and steel I'm strong I tell ya My shape was built for environmental practicality To let natural light and airflow reach the San Francisco streets at 853 feet tall, I'm 7th tallest here, you know. But the 2nd tallest.
tallest building in San Francisco. Al Faisalia Center in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. Built with steel and concrete, and this I will share with you. I was the first skyscraper built in Saudi Arabia, you know. There are many taller than me now, come visit me though. I'm 876 feet tall, if measured to my tip, I am considered a pyramid and I'm 8th on this list. I'm called the Shard, I'm located in London, UK. I have 11,000 glass panels, come here and stay. I'm 1,016 feet tall and take a pyramid shape. I'm the tallest building in the UK, I like to skyscrape. Leung Hotel in Pyongyang, North Korea. The world's tallest unoccupied building, I will show ya. I'm considered the tallest modern pyramid of all at 1,082.7 feet tall. We are pyramids, yeah, we're all man made. We are architecture of new and ancient ancestry. We are pyramids. Of old and modern time, we will show you our location. Come visit us and climb. We'll have a whale of a time deep in the ocean as we dive. You'll see the smallest of whales and see how large they can thrive. Whales are classified as mammals, you're a lot like them, you know. They're all milk secreting, warm blooded vertebrate animals. I'm a barnacle, I'm always stuck on a whale. around seven feet and four to six hundred pounds and it loves to eat meat they eat cephalopods that's right squids and octopus they also love crustaceans crab and shrimp they taste really good they're a toothed whale in a group called the Dontacity. they swim in temperate and tropical oceans to feel free here's a pygmy right whale at a length of 21 feet weighing 7500 pounds finding food no easy feet. They feed on copepods, a microscopic crustacean. They also feed on krill, a crustacean on the run. They filter feed their food through baleen and are classified in a group called Mr. Cetai. Here's a minky whale. They're about 18 feet and commonly weigh 12,000 pounds. To watch them is quite a treat. They feed primarily on krill and on some small schooling fish. Copepods are on their menu, that's one hefty dish. Minkies are classified as Mr. Cetai as well. That means they feed through baleen. They filter really swell. This is a gray whale at a length of 45 feet and weighs 60,000 pounds. They'll surface for you to meet. Amphipods are a gray Like animals, that's what they like to pursue. A brood as well, its length is 55 feet and weigh up to 30 tons. That's 60,000 pounds, you see. They mainly feed on crustaceans and cephalopods and fish, too. They're part of the Mr. Cetai, a baleen whale, that's true. You know, the humpback whale, 52 feet in length, shown here at 66,000 pounds. They don't have much fear. They mainly feed on crystals. a say whale 55 feet in their length at a hundred thousand pounds you know they've got some strength they feed on two thousand pounds of food per day they eat copepods krill small fish and cephalopods i'd say here's the right whale they're 59 feet long and 160 thousand pounds i wonder how they get along they feed on euphosiid and copepods now song. Euphosiids and copepods are their main diet they lead. Mr. Cetai is their group filtering food through their baleen. Here you see a blue whale. Its length is a hundred feet. 330,000 pounds. Staying afloat is quite a feat. They can eat four tons of krill on a daily basis. They're also Mr. Cetai. Thank you for learning this. We'll have a whale of a time deep in the ocean as we dive. You'll 
you'll see the smallest of whales and see how large they can thrive. Whales are classified as mammals, you're a lot like them, you know. They're all milk secreting, warm blooded vertebrate animals. This is a country comparison by size. We'll show you with our square mileage. Yeah, we'll keep you advised with this country comparison by size. We'll go from small to large. It may come as some surprise. I'm Vatican City and Monaco. This is Nauru and Tuvalu did show. San Marino here and Liechtenstein. The Marshall Islands, St. Kitts and Nevis are fine. Maldives are next, Malta is small. I'm Granada, St. Vincent and Grenadines to call. Barbados, Antigua and Barbuda, the Seychelles. Allow it's nice to meet ya, Pandora is here. St. Lucia, there's more. Micronesia and Singapore. Welcome to Tonga. Dominica, you see, I am Bahrain and Karabati, Sao Tome and Principe, Mauritius is close, this is Luxembourg, and I'm Comoros, here's Samoa, Cape Verde in your eye, Trinidad and Tobago, then Brunei, this is Cyprus, and Lebanon, Jamaica Mon, Gambia's the one, Here's Qatar and Vanuatu, Montenegro, Bahamas stays true. East to more than Swaziland, Kuwait and Fiji understand. Slovenia and El Salvador, Israel, Belize there's more. Djibouti, Macedonia, Rwanda. Haiti showed ya, Burundi, Equatorial Guinea, Solomon Islands, Albania, you see, Armenia. I'm Lesotho, Belgium, Moldova sees you, Guinea Bissau, and I'm Bhutan, Switzerland, Netherlands has got it going on, Denmark, Estonia. Dominican Republic and Slovakia, Costa Rica, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Croatia, Togo, nice to meet ya, Latvia, Lithuania, Sri Lanka, and Georgia, the Republic of Ireland, Sierra Leone here, Panama, Czech Republic just appeared, the United Arab Emirates, Austria, Azerbaijan, and Serbia, Jordan, Portugal, Hungary, South Korea is full, Iceland, Guatemala, Cuba, Bulgaria, Liberia, Honduras, I'm Benin, Eritrea won't fuss, Malawi, North Korea, peace, Nicaragua, and I am Greece, Tajikistan, Nepal, Bangladesh, Tunisia has it all, Suriname, Uruguay, Cambodia, Syria is fly, Senegal, Kyrgyzstan, Belarus, Guyana has a plan, Laos, Romania, I'm Ghana, Uganda see ya, the United Kingdom, I'm Guinea, Gabon, New Zealand, that is me, Burkina Faso, Ecuador, Philippines, Italy, on to more, Oman, and Poland, Ivory Coast, and Malaysia, I stand, Vietnam, Finland, that's me, Republic of the Congo, and Germany, Japan, and Norway, Zimbabwe, Paraguay, I 
USA, Iraq, Morocco, Uzbekistan, Sweden the show, Papua New Guinea, Cameroon, Turkmenistan, Spain will see you soon, Thailand, Yemen is far, Kenya, and Madagascar, Botswana, Ukraine is what I pick, South Sudan, Central African Republic, Somalia, France, Afghanistan, Myanmar stands a chance, Zambia, Chile, Turkey, Mozambique, come and play, Namibia, Pakistan, Venezuela, Nigeria on demand, Tanzania, Egypt you saw, Mauritania, and Bolivia, Ethiopia, Colombia you see, South Africa, and I am Mali, Angola, Niger, Chad, Peru, there's nothing finer, Mongolia, Iran, Libya, Sudan, Indonesia, Mexico, Saudi Arabia, Democratic Republic of the Congo, Algeria, Kazakhstan, Argentina, India is the plan, Australia, Brazil is south, China is here, USA is not south, I'm Canada, Russia is the last and the biggest country in the world, I have class. This is a country comparison by size, we'll show you with our square mileage, yeah we'll keep you advised with this country comparison by size, we'll go from small to large, it may come as some surprise. With an estimated visible diameter of a hundred to two hundred thousand light years across me. I'm the Milky Way. This song is about facts of my galaxy. I'm not the biggest, but I'm the one you call home. Actually, I am the Milky Way, the galaxy you are. A part of your solar system's a small part of me. Here's more of me you love. Your galaxy is a gravitationally bound collection of stars and a spiral swirling through space. That's what you know about me this far. I am one and about two in this observable universe let's give some examples of my size in the coming verse i do have a radius which is measured from my center to the edge of me which in light years measures 52,850 when you measure me from one edge across my entirety, I'm about a hundred thousand light years across, as you can plainly see. I do probably contain 100 to 400 billion stars, you know. That's an estimate that humans created, but there could be more to show to give you an example of my size well we'll look to my neighbor and see the spectacle goes by the name of the andromeda galaxy if you measure the andromeda across from one side to the other it's about 220,000 light years wide it's my big brother this 
glasses I see 1101 Galaxy I will now share It spans as much as 4 million light years That's a lot bigger if we're compared There are a lot of other things Bigger than this called super clusters Laniakea is a good example I am part of its hard to muster. The Laniakea supercluster is thought to be in size 520 million light years, an estimate humans had comprised. The next time you think Earth is the center of the universe, you know, remember your just a speck floating in trillions of galaxies in a space unknown. My name is Four Vesta, the asteroid, one of the largest asteroids in the asteroid belt. Please enjoy. The asteroid belt is located roughly between Mars and Jupiter. I'm the second largest asteroid on the scene. I was discovered by German astronomer Hendrik Olbers, and that is for sure. In the month of March in 1807, After the Roman goddess of home and hearth It was easy and flawless I was named by the famous mathematician called Frederick Gauss He was such a vision I am one of the largest objects you should know In the asteroid belt is where I glow The asteroid belt is located roughly between the orbits of Jupiter this is the second largest known asteroid by both mass and by volume. That's knowledge to enjoy. I'm the second largest two dwarf planet series. The closest dwarf to the sun in your solar system. See, my mean diameter is 525 kilometers or 326 miles if the metric system's unfamiliar. I'm the brightest asteroid that is visible from Earth, but not quite a dwarf. I guess I need some worker at a distance of 220 million kilometers from the planet of Earth. For what that is worth, NASA's Dawn spacecraft entered orbit around me in the year of 2011, July the 16th. Dawn stayed for a one year exploration and left my orbit when it reached its completion on the 5th of September in 2012. I hope you Asteroids in the asteroid belt from biggest to smallest, their names are spelled Ceres, Vesta, Pallas, and Hygieia. That's enough about me, yeah, I guess I will see ya. My name is Four Vesta, the asteroid, one of the largest asteroids in the asteroid belt. Please enjoy. The asteroid belt is located roughly between Mars and Jupiter. I'm the second largest asteroid on the scene. 